The CBS2 investigators found police have been called to this house in the past. CBS2 investigator Megan Hickey joins us live from the scene with what we've learned about that. Megan? Right, Joe and Marie, investigators here on the scene are not confirming that man's identity. They say they're waiting for official confirmation from the Cook County Medical Examiner's Office. But what we can tell you is that this home was the center of a domestic violence incident back in 2016. On December 5, 2016, Oak Forest police were called to this home, according to Cook County court records. A now 44-year-old man was arrested and charged with domestic battery and criminal damage to property. The victim was a now 43-year-old woman. Court records show they were, at least at one point, married. An order of protection was granted for the wife, but it was vacated just nine days later on December 14, 2016. And the domestic violence charges were dropped. At that time, the man had a valid FOID card and his firearms were returned to him, according to Cook County court records. It's unclear if that man still has a valid FOID card. Property records are still in that husband and wife's name and cars registered to both of them are parked in front of the home. But again, at least right now, investigators are not confirming the identity of the shooter, so we are not naming either of them. Now, neighbors who live nearby tell us that the man who lived in the home was a U.S. Marine and you can see this white car parked in front of the home does have a USMC emblem on the license plate. We also saw police as they were leaving take a handgun and put it into evidence. Live in Oak Forest, Megan Hickey, CBS 2 Investigators. Megan, thank you. We broke the story on our streaming network, CBS News Chicago, and here on CBS 2. You can always track breaking news stories and other local news on our app. Just scan the QR code on the bottom of your screen.